So I'm not in the best of moods. I just recorded two lessons and realized I had the microphone plugged in the headphone jack. So nothing. All right, so one half life. This is uh, atomic physics. Physics five point. I don't know. I would say five point one B technically, but it's five point one D on the syllabus. But it's just part B for the video. So half life is the amount of time for the mass of the nucleus to drop to half as what it was, or the count rate on the Geiger counter to go to half of what it was. Um, the best way I explain half-life is with grocery shopping and the refrigerator, all right? So let's say on Monday your mom goes grocery shopping, and every day you empty the, fri and you empty the fridge b by half every day, all right? So every day you come home and eat half of the food in the fridge. So on Monday you eat four apples because there were eight. Okay, and then on Tuesday, you eat two of the apples because there were four. And then on Wednesday, you eat one because there were two. And on Thursday, you eat half because there was one. So you get the picture. So the fridge in that example, or the groceries, have a half life of one day. Every day, the food drops by half of what was there. So let's take this bulk pack of ch ketchup, for example. There are 64 ketchups in the bulk pack of ketchup. And every, and this bulk pack has a half-life of three days. So how long would it take for there to only be two ketchups left? So from 64 to 32 would be one day. Oh, it has a half-life of three days. I've made this wrong. Let me hit pause and change it. Yeah, when I first made the example, I thought a half-life of one day was crazy. So the bulk pack has 64 ketchups. It has a half-life of three days. How long until only two are left? So let's take a peek at how we work that. So from 64 to 32 would take three days, because that's the half-life. So then from 32 to 64 to 16 takes three days. Then 16 to 8 takes three days. Then half of 8 is 4, three days. Half of 4 is 2, three days. So we got to 2. Now we just look at what's there. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. It takes 15 days for the 64 pack of ketchup to reach, was it 64? Yeah, to reach two. That's how half-life works. Same idea, just that you're looking at a nucleus or you're looking at the, uh, the count rate, okay? Um, uses of, oopsies, uses of radioactivity. And if we click on this link, oopsies. So if we click on the link, we get to BBC Bite Size, I, I, um, and we see some uses for radioactivity. So one is tracers um, for pipes. You put something radioactive down the drain, and you can follow it with a Geiger counter. Um, and wherever it stops beeping is where the uh, leak is or where the blockage is. Um, a big one is smoke alarms. They use smoke alarms to um, figure out. They use, sorry, uh, Americ, Americ, I should have just stopped this. Let me stop. <laughs>